Tom Sewell drove his 2009 Chevy work truck more than 500 miles from his home in Tulsa, Oklahoma to Tupelo without breaking the bank. On $25 worth of compressed natural gas. Sewell is president of Tulsa Gas Technologies Incorporated. He is at the annual meeting of the Mississippi Natural Gas Association to show others in the industry the advantages of using CNG in vehicles. Right now, uh, compressed natural gas retails in Oklahoma for $1.69 for the same energy as a gallon of gasoline. So when I mean the same energy, if I go 14 miles on a gallon of gasoline, I can go 14 miles on a gallon of compressed natural gas. When I mean compressed natural gas, it's the same gas you cook and heat with at home, but we compress it where you can run it in your car. Sewell's company manufactures CNG commercial fueling stations, which look a lot like regular gasoline pumps. There are smaller versions for homeowners and other businesses. The issue has captured the attention of lawmakers in Jackson. In fact, Sewell, his associates, and others at the conference took a few moments to watch a live video feed of Governor Phil Bryant as he signed a memorandum of understanding with 11 other governors, encouraging automakers to increase production of vehicles fueled by natural gas. Even Congress is taking notice. A bill pending on Capitol Hill known as the Nat Gas Act would provide billions of dollars in incentives to use CNG as a transport fuel. Of course, there's a lot of opposition to that bill, but Sewell and others in the industry believe that as gas prices continue to rise, public outcry will force lawmakers to take action. In Tupelo, I'm Allie Martin, WCBI News.